Hey there YouTube, Vince here. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys a tutorial on how to create an efficient obsidian farm inside of Minecraft. Okay, so let me go ahead and show you guys what the product will look like once it's done and how it will work. Alright, before we begin, I would like to let you guys know that I am using two mods today. One will be single player console commands, so I can change the time of day, change the weather, I'm invulnerable to lava so I don't die during this tutorial, etc. Okay. The other one is in-game inventory editor, so I can just give myself lava. Alright, so I'm not spending all day just, you know, getting lava and putting it into putting it in. So uh, Let me just go ahead and do this. Okay. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Okay, so now you can see um, I have four tanks of obsidian farm. Okay. Um, just a helpful hint, I would recommend building this near a lava spring. Okay. Because you will be going through a lot of lava. Okay. So. Let me go ahead and give myself a uh, bucket of water. I'll show you guys a little bit how this works. So, the way obsidian is created is water must flow on top of, over the top of, a full p a full block of lava. Okay. So, how this will work is when I put the water up there, it will flow down on top, and we just pick it back up. And there we go. And we do the same here. And there we go. So as you can see, four tanks of obsidian. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and I know it's fairly self-explanatory on how to build these. I mean, it's not that hard. But I'm still going to go ahead and show you guys just in case there's points on where you're confused. Okay, so what you're going to be needing for this is really just a shovel and glass. If you're going to follow mine, you don't need glass, but that's what I build it with. And, you know, you can use whatever you want. Alrighty, so the tanks are 11 blocks long and 5 blocks wide. So I'm going to go ahead and build one right here. Okay, so what I usually do is I just get the 5 first. Then if you look at the pattern I used, I just alternate the blocks in the middle. These blocks are here so you can fill the pits up with lava without killing yourself. Okay, so I just dig, leave it, dig, leave it, etc all the way down. So, let's do that. Find the center, dig the first one, skip one, dig the next one, next one. Okay. Oh, forgot one. Okay, right there. Then we go ahead and burr, dig out the sides of it. Okay. So you can see we have our pit now. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to finish um, bordering it with glass. Okay. Now you want to get into the middle. You're going to want to put one there. I usually like to make this one a little one higher than the rest, just so I don't hit my head on it. Alright. Okay, so here's the tank. That's all there's to it. To load it, all you need to do, I will be using um, the lava, the lava entity itself. I won't actually be using lava buckets, although if you're doing it without these mods, you will be doing it with buckets. Okay. Um... Like I said, I'm just using this to save time in this tutorial. So, in order for this to work, you must hit each block and fill each block with lava. So, what I usually do is I just start at one end, 
and just move right on down. You'll be able to tell if you missed a block because lava will appear to be flowing towards the block that doesn't have a piece. Like watch, I'll show you guys that in just a second. Okay. You guys can see how those pieces, it looks like it's flowing into it. That means that that isn't a complete block. Okay. So let's just go ahead and finish filling this up. Alright. Doesn't look like there's any flow. Let me go ahead and turn this uh, rain off. Oh. There we go. Alrighty. So, and that's all. That's all there is to it. Then get yourself a bucket of lava. Put it on top. And mine yourself your obsidian. Alrighty, folks. If you have any questions or comments or even suggestions on my next tutorial, feel free to message me or comment on this video. And uh, don't forget to thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Peace out, guys.